Hey you peeps, it's Trisha Cromwell, stylist with Trust and Trisha. And like I said to everyone, I was gonna go live from TJ Maxx today, and I meant it, look. Oh, I'm here. I'm here, I feel like a major weirdo talking to myself in my phone while people are walking by and shopping and looking at me. But I have crucial information to share and I can't withhold it from the world. So let them stare, let them listen. I might even help them with their shopping trip. Like I literally, I, I took a seat, see? <laughs> this is me seated in the department <laughs> to come to you. Now, why do I wanna talk about TJ Maxx? It is one of my favorite stores. And I think really because I love designer fashion, but I love getting it for a lower price. I mean, don't we all, right? And it's really, it's really about the fun. It's almost like a scavenger hunt to see what you find in these stores. Um, and then kind of comparing and just what you may see in department stores that may be full price that TJ Maxx has currently in season. And I think that a lot of um, myths about this store are just that everything that they carry is irregular or you can't find anything that's new. And th there are some irregular things in the store. So I definitely recommend um, for my first tip when you're shopping here is to try everything on. Sometimes there isn't a regular fit and usually the tag's pretty good about saying so, um, but definitely try, try on. And my second tip about this store is do not put anything down. I kid you not. They get inventory here every day and it flies. This isn't like your typical department store chain where you think if you see something in store that you really like, you can come back and snag it on payday. You cannot, it will be gone. It's bananas. I'll even tell you, one time I was in Home Goods because the TJ Maxx with the Home Goods combined are my favorite. I was in Home Goods and I saw a bright pink, like Trust and Trisha colored mannequin, a bust form. It was super cute for displays. I thought it would be so great for my events, like my clothing swaps, how I usually have the mannequins and kind of dress them up, which plug my next clothing swap is with Easton Women of Today again, and that is in Easton in April. But anyway, I saw a pink mannequin and I thought this would be perfect for me to have like in my office or, you know, at events. I left, I, I think I went to go pick my friend up or we had to pick our son up from daycare or something, came back and it was gone. I mean, it was like two hours later and a $50 pink half bust form mannequin was sold. Like who even bought that? Who even needed that besides me? I thought it was a match made in heaven. So they do have a 30 day money back guarantee policy with your receipt and tags attached. Don't put anything down if you see it in the store. And if it's like a home decor item or a furniture piece, don't think that you can take a picture of it and bring it home and see if it'll fit into your house because you can't, trust me. Just buy it, bring it home to your house, see if it fit, and then bring it back if it doesn't because if you're banking on it to be there, it will not. Um, and like I had mentioned, the TJ Maxx with the home goods attached are like my favorite to shop in because it's like, home decor crazy actually I'm gonna show you because I saw this example over here don't mind me I'm in my favorite section but we'll talk about that in a minute so their home decor pieces are amazing and just super cheap so I had actually seen this it's just a set of three mirrors but look at this price can you see that $12.99 for this set of three mirrors to go on your wall. I was at Target yesterday and saw something similar for $30. So if you're looking for houseware items, home decor items, or like all of these great office space and desk items, for sure check here first. Something else that's really good to get here that I get a lot is pet goods like doggy beds, they run for like $80 in some places. You can get them for like $20 here. So definitely look on my dog's bowls are from here, all of his beds. Something else fabulous to get here is luggage you can really save. Um, there are a couple things that are not so great to get here. And in my opinion, those are like towels and curtains. They frustrate me because what happens is these stores just get random inventory every day and they're kind of, isn't always a rhyme or reason to it. So what's frustrating is you could come in and find the perfect color towel to match your bathroom or the perfect curtain for your house. But there's literally 
one curtain panel and you can't find the other one everywhere. What's also frustrating about TJ Maxx is they don't have a computer inventory system or they can't call other stores to check if they have an item. So you're literally on a mission to try to find the next TJ Maxx, the next Marshalls, the next Home Goods to see if they have that item. Trust me, I've been on these missions and they are crazy and sometimes I think it's fun. But if you have an immediate project in your home, don't do it to yourself. It's kind of crazy. But do come for the designer items, the purses and the shoes, because I do like to spend a little on my purses and shoes. The discounts here are great. Um, and before you come, you know, just make sure that you've price matched and you kind of see what's out there, what's in department stores now, what's online now, so that you see that you're actually getting a crazy deal. And speaking of crazy deals, I actually wanted to come and chat from this store because they have a runway section. Can you see that? So not all stores have a runway section. If one does not near you, you should definitely check their website for locations because the deals are crazy. For example, oh, oh Gucci, is that you in a TJ Maxx? Crazy. What else? Oh, oh, Valentino. No big deal. Just the signature Valentino heel for only $7.99. And if you know designer, you know that that is crazy and I actually saw some pieces because I wanted to talk to you about the tags excuse me don't mind my weird self nope. I'm Facebook living yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna move these I kind of think it <laughs> do people do this often <laughs> okay so I pulled a couple of things to show you guys about the tags and why I wanted to come in now to a TJ Maxx is because Prices are already cheap, but there are two times a year that they actually mark things down even further. And this is the yellow ticket clearance. They do it in January and they do it in July to clear out seasonally for inventory. Sometimes it's kind of top secret and they don't always announce what they're, when they're doing it. But if you're on their mailing list, they'll send you a list. Or if you still don't even want to wait for their mailing list and you're like me, you'll just stalk them and go to a bunch of different stores because I'm not kidding, that's what I do. So here's the situation. First we have the red ticket. So obviously the prices already are super cheap and a lot of times they'll put compare as and you can tell what the department stores sold them for and what TJ Maxx is selling it for. So their first markdown will be a red ticket. So like this one here. This is a Kate Spade sweater that was regularly compare at 180. Here it's 99 and now they marked it down to 69 with the red ticket. Great, awesome, it's a sale. However, when you see yellow ticket, jump on it. And that looks like this. Can you see that? Okay, so the yellow ticket, that's like crazy. Get it right now. As it is, every TJ Maxx piece is unique and you may never find it again. But if it's that yellow ticket and it's been marked down in that deep of a discount, you have to grab it. So red ticket is a clearance, which is a great price. Yellow ticket happens only two times a year, January and July, so jump on that. And then the runway section, you can tell is runway, which is literally designer. Sometimes it's showroom samples, it's lookbook samples, items that models actually wore on the runway or that they use to sell in product to accounts. Anything from a runway store will have a, I'm having trouble, a purple ticket like this. So the purple ticket means runway, it means designer, and this, this dress right here bananas. It's Ralph Lauren. You, you have to see. Like insanity, right? Sequins, feathers, like it's crazy. Look at the original price because the original ticket is still on this. I don't know it's backwards to you all, but 44, almost $4,500, $44.95 original retail for this Ralph Lauren dress which I actually had somebody that wanted me to find this for them cheaper. It's funny, Katie, if you're watching, it's still here, apparently, which is crazy. But the TJ Maxx price, a thousand. So TJ Maxx was selling it for a thousand. They already marked it down with the red ticket, and now they marked it again to 299. Yellow ticket to, hello. 299 for this $4,500 dress. That's bananas. Now, it's the only one, if you're not a size eight, you're out of luck or you're buying it for someone or like me you're buying it for a model to use in a styled photo shoot here's another example bananas see as you can see like my major fashion high from TJ Maxx it's nuts 
Like at first I was nervous to like go live in here because everybody would look at me like I was crazy. And then as soon as I came into the <laughs> runway section, I saw all these deals. I got like my major shopping high on. I don't even really care. I don't care if I have a, a parade of people following me because this is good stuff. Like get out of here. Okay, look. Can you please? This is a Hervé Leger bandage dress. <gasps> what? So mad it only fits one of my legs because it's an extra small but let's look at the tag 1450 euro which means us dollars a lot tj maxx selling it for 499 yellow ticket 149 that's an herve dress for 150 dollars that is bananas so if you have a runway store and you're like way too into designers like i am Go to it and especially go to it now like ASAP because this is when the clearance is and if you don't grab some friends myself included because I'm down to go and take a field trip there are only a couple of runway stores in mass in Rhode Island a lot of them are next to home goods stores and there's always like a restaurant or a Starbucks so like we can make a field trip out of this I'm not even kidding um, but that's kind of my TJ Maxx rundown. So I just wanted to share with you guys, um, you know, definitely come in. They get items every day. So check back. If you saw something you think you can come back for, you probably can't. So grab it as soon as you see it. Check every day for new stuff. Research to make sure that you know what prices are out there and you understand the deal that you're getting. Um, the jewelry department here is really good, but the markdown is still high. So I definitely compare before I buy jewelry. Purses and shoes, however, definitely a good discount and many times they have items that are currently this season in major department stores for full price. So as long as you research and you know what the prices are, you know the deal that you're getting and you can celebrate and you can buy even more because you're saving money. Okay, is that just my theory? I don't know. Um, I am going to sign out before I get kicked out. I can't believe I haven't yet. And I think I'm going to go actually into the women's section. Oh, before I forget, active wear, I love to buy here for like the whole one time a month that I go to the gym. But anyway, active wear is really cheap. Um, sometimes I see the girls at the gym with like the matching three piece and they look so cute and then I want to buy it and I come to TJ Maxx and try and I can't because they only have one piece out of that set. It is how it is, but you're getting it for 50, 60% off, so you can't complain. Um, I also get, a, like, almost all of my denim here, because I love premium denim. Um, a big booty girl. Jess, I know you asked about that in my survey on what I should talk about on Facebook Live. Um, so I definitely find that the premium denim in the curvy fits fit really well. I love, um, like, Paige jeans, Hudson's, Joe's jeans, and a lot of those are, I don't know why I keep tilting my phone, I don't know what I'm doing, um, but a lot of those are deeply discounted here. I mean, you can get them for 59 to 79 as opposed to 180 and up in department and in retail stores. So... I mean, I pretty much come here for everything. When I have to buy a cute outfit for a baby, for like a baby shower or a gift, I come here for that because the name brand things are crazy. Even when I worked at Ralph Lauren and I would come here to shop, there would be current season items that were currently in department stores and in Ralph Lauren retail stores that were here at a fraction of the cost. So it's a great place to save money, um, but definitely strategize, pay attention, and kind of know what you're looking for and have fun. And if there's a runway section, again, let me just let me just get this sign in here. If there's a runway section, hit it. I'm telling you. So I'm signing out. Thanks for paying attention to another Trisha's Tips Tuesday. And if anyone needs a pal to go shopping with them, I'm your girl.